Hi, my name is Ayam Doimano, and this is my channel. If you are interested in learning graphic design, consider subscribing to the channel. If you have a friend or anybody who is also interested, kindly share the link to them. Let them subscribe and learn for free. Thank you for watching my videos. So today I'm going to show you how to create the drip effect in Adobe Photoshop. How to create the drip effect in Adobe Photoshop. So like I always say, when you open Photoshop, this is how it looks like. When you open Photoshop, this is how it looks like. So before I go straight into the video, if today is your first time, please subscribe to the channel. If today is your first time seeing a video like this, or if you are interested in learning graphic design, please subscribe to the channel. Let's go straight into the video. So you go to file, we are going to select our sheet to create the effect that we want. So you go to file, click on new, select your sheet. This is for social media. Do you get it? You are not going to print. So you select your sheet. I will select six by six inches. The resolution, I'll make it 300. I'll leave it at RGB color because I'm not going to print. Then I'll click on create, as you can see. And this is the sheet that I'm going to use. So when you check here, it's locked. Double click on it, click OK. Then it's unlock they get it or you can simply click here on the, the lock here bring it here leave it and it will unlock they get it so this is the picture i'm going to use this is one and this is the drip effect here i'm going to show you i'm going to add to the picture so what i'll do is i'll crop the picture it is locked double click click ok to unlock so now i'll crop the picture this is the magic one too you click it click on the background click on properties scroll down and you will see remove background click on it and it will remove the background for you so there we have it you see the background is gone so now what you do is click and you move the picture to the working sheet or the working space get it so like this let's zoom inside now let's bring the drip effect let's bring it here uh -huh. make sure to align it well okay so increase the size zoom okay so let's take away this white line here delete okay now let's take this one up okay Let's reduce it a bit. okay so let's change the color go to color overlay click here no let's use gradient so you go to basics select this one Let's change 
click here good click here click on ok and let's change this color to the middle one click on ok ok okay so you click on okay let's zoom out and this is what we have can you see it this is the drip effect in photoshop this is how to create it very simple you get it This is the drip effect. So let me bring the picture here. Let me zoom it. So do you see it? This is the effect and this is the picture. We get it. So it's very simple. Very, very simple. So guys, if this is your first time, kindly subscribe to the channel. If you're interested in learning graphic design, please subscribe to the channel. So let me draw. Let me draw a background. Let me put a background. So you get it this is the drip how to create a drip effect in photoshop so guys if this is your first time please subscribe to the channel and see you next time bye bye